I was 40 years old. I was running a fish house, Formosa. They had managed to start discharging without a permit. And up in the bay, there was uh, some sort of mutation going on with black drum. The whole side of the drum was rotting out, and their intestines were showing it. When you're at the fish house and you have fishermen who come and want to get ice, and they said, the alligators are rolling. They're at the surface, and they're just rolling in the water. And, and then you have shrimpers who bring you shrimp, and it looks like they've been stuffed with cotton. And then you start see where they can't even go out and make a living anymore. So all their boats are tied up. And then the fish houses, they shut out. They destroyed the community here. The community is no longer. You talk to any shrimper and it's like, my kid is not gonna do this. And all you have are closed areas or shut down bays. Don't eat the crabs, don't eat the shrimp, don't eat the fish. I work for the end of plastic, the age of plastic. That's what I work for. We came out here every day for two and a half years, and we got 2,500 samples of illegal discharges, and we took them to court. We eventually settled for $50 million, and we put it into every environmental project in this community. We put every penny back into the community to help them.